Hi, this is Sriyash and today we are going to see what is an inversion in a time cycle. Okay, so let's get started. So let's consider Nifty 50 as the forecast. Okay, and this is for the January and February 2022 month. So let's start from January 27th as the low, which is forecasted then February 2nd is the high then February 7th is the low 16th February is forecasted as high 21st of February is the low and 28th February is forecasted as high okay so let's see what happened to these pivots so let me bring up the nifty 50 chart for the month of February so here is the chart uh, so left side left side you can see uh, we have a forecast 27th of January is the low and 2nd February is the high so let's go and mark this up so we have a low here on 27th and 2nd of February is high okay then let's go to the next pivot 7th february is the low okay. and here we have a low on 7th february this is 8th february we can take that then uh, next is uh, 16th february is the high so we have a higher on 10th and we have a low here on 15th okay so so this area doesn't look good to me from 7th of uh, february low we went up high on 10th then came back came down on 15th and then went up again till 21st of february and then we are coming down so this this is something which doesn't look good to me so here what we will have to do we will have to consider an extra pivot in this cycle now february 2nd is high 7th is low then we will have to add one more pivot over here uh, which is a high pivot then 16th February will become a low 21st February will become high and then 20th February will become low let's try out that okay so let me delete this so let's say uh, we have a high here on 10th then uh, 16 february will be low instead of high so here we have a low on 15th we can take that it's one day off then 21st of february is will be high then we have a high here on 21st okay we can take that then we are going low till 28th of february okay we can take that and this video is recorded on 26th of february 2022 okay so we do not have this 28th or 1st of march date yet so we will have to see what happens on monday but uh, I think we have a low pivot here uh, on 25th instead of 28th because 26th and 27th is a holiday okay it's a weekend so technically um, Monday's pivot uh, forecasted pivot can come on Friday okay that is uh, one day of one day either side so we can have a pivot on 28th or 25th okay so to summarize 
uh, inversion is an simply an extra pivot that gets uh, added to our time cycle okay uh, so uh, from uh, 2nd of February high we went to 7 February low then 7 February low we went to 10th February high which is an extra inverted pivot then uh, from 10th high we went to 16th low 16th low we went to 21st high and from 21st February high we are going to 28th February as a low okay so how many inversions do occur in a year in a stock or commodity so really it depends on stock to stock or commodity to commodity normally what I trade in nifty 50 and what I have seen is that two to three inversions occur every year in nifty 50 and I have seen in some other Indian stocks we may even get seven to eight inversions every year so the answer is it depends on uh, instrument to instrument okay so if you want to learn about these time cycles how to forecast the time cycles in uh, your stock or commodity then you can join our courses the details of the courses are provided on the website niftycycles.in also if you want to know the next month's forecast in indian indices and stocks such as nifty 50 bank nifty reliance industries tcs and hdfc bank then um, the forecasts are also available under the newsletter sections on our website and if you have liked this video then do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. See you in the next video.